You went away. You already know I'm not happy, you know. Yeah. I'm just coming back from Nigeria embassy now. I applied online. Like they said I have to do. The day I called them to book appointment. The system did not accept the credit card. It's telling me that my name, since I'm not applying, that I cannot pay uh, for the people I'm applying for. But the people that are applying for, they are my kids and they are bearing the same on them, like me, that what is in the credit card. So I don't know the reason why it should be that way. Okay, now, to cut it short. I had an appointment. I went there. We were in the cold, waiting outside with other people, you know, my two kids. Then after like a one hour, or one hour, and so they called us in. Then I went to submit my documents. And now, the guy I submitted the documents is telling me that I have to pay uh, 270 francs, you know? Which is, which how, is how much more than the initial almost, price? Almost uh, 90 francs, you know? On top. on top, mm -hmm. you know? So I said, okay, no problem, but I will pay that. I came here with you, one, it's three francs, but if you, if, if you want it, because I need the passport, I'll go outside to the bank and then get money to complete it. But I want receipt for that because I want to know why. So they were like, no, they can't give, there's no receipt for to that. To cut the thing short, after argument for more than 30 minutes to 40 minutes, now, now that they now told me that it's even better that I don't make the passport, I apply, because there's no booklets to make passport that they don't have since October. Why is it like this? Must we always suffer people in order for us to have what we want to have? I mean, I'm so mad and... Uh, I went last two days to make renew my little boy passport, his Swiss passport. It took me only 15 minutes. So why was I driving all this long to Bern and then spend all this whole day? I didn't go to work. Nobody pays me for that yesterday. My kids didn't go to school today. Oh God, why? Why, 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 why? I didn't want to make this video, but I was so mad that this is so frustrating that I was like, no, I have to make my voice heard. And I want a stop to this nonsense. If you people doesn't have material to process passport, please put it on your website so that when people are going to, in to apply, they will see there is no material to work on. Now they, they, can, they cannot decide if they still want to make the appointment and come and then wait. Captured and then wait when their passport is ready, they come and pick it. Or they decide to wait when the material they can, they can go. Or they get ma. It's not good. Or they get ma. It's not good. Pikonu, please, please, ambassador in Switzerland, you have to put your, just look into this issue and then with the immigration people you're working with, just know how to do this and then so that people will come there, you give them good service. When they are going, they will talk good about their embassy and they will feel good. This drama is not the first time I'm coming to embassy and face drama. There have been, it has been happening. Anytime I want to go there, it's all which drama will I meet. Well, mental I, preparation. You know, exactly, but <laughs> this time around, I've never gone to video or live or video, but this one was too much for me to bear. That's why I'm making this video. Please, you people have to look into this and find a better way to serve your people. That's what I'm trying to tell you guys and nothing more. Please, thank you.